After five months of hard work in the snow crested Lesser Kingdom Mountains in northeast China, the movie The Three Body Problem has finally finished filming. The movie is based on the science fiction novel of the same name, written by Chinese author Liu Cixin. The novel became the first Chinese sci fi book to win the Hugo Award for Best Novel last Sunday. The award is considered a breakthrough for Chinese sci fi writers. However, compared with Hollywood sci fi blockbusters, some people still doubt the experience and capability of the Yan film directing team. But author Liu Cixin says he is confident. When the U.S. sci-fi movie saw a boom in the 1980s, they were also not directed by the mainstream directors at that time, but by a bunch of young directors dedicated to science fiction. They were a marginalized group during that period. So, as for our domestic sci-fi movies, I'd rather put bigger hope on those who are young, energetic, and creative. The three-body problem discusses human responses to alien invasions during China's Cultural Revolution, and it has sold more than a million copies in China. The book was also introduced to the U.S. in an English translation last year. The movie has now entered the post-production process in the hands of a team that was once in charge of the special effects for such blockbusters as Avatar, Harry Potter, and Life of Pi. A team of around 600 people will be dealing with the post-production of the movie The Three-Body Problem, and it will take the team one year's time to finish the work. Our core team has much experience because we have handled similar Hollywood projects in the past. Yang said it is the team's goal to present as spectacular visual effects as in the Star Trek movies. Statistics show that during the 17 years between 1995 and 2011, the Chinese mainland produced only eight science fiction movies, while 287 were made in the U.S. during that same time period. The movie is scheduled to be released in the summer of 2016. Zhongshi, CCTV.